Hey guys, I just wanted to do a quick video. Um, I was going to videotape yesterday, but it was a busy day and I got really nervous, so I didn't. <laughs> I didn't, I just completely forgot. Um, I had my breast augmentation surgery yesterday. Everything went really, really well. Um, today I had my post-op surgery and um, I haven't gotten to see what they look like yet. I should hopefully get to see them on Thursday, so I'm really excited. Um, they did put two different sizes in for me because um, one of my breasts was larger than the other. So they put a smaller size in that one and then my uh, the goal size in the other one um, to kind of even them out. Um, the surgery was not... I was way more nervous for the surgery and I didn't, didn't need to be that nervous. Uh, it went really, really well. Um, the surgical center we went to was phenomenal. Everybody was so nice and they kept me nice and comfortable. Um, the anesthesiologist, it was really funny when he came in, he was like, okay, I'm going to give you the good stuff. And within seconds, I was having a giggle fit because I, like everything started going blurry and they were like, okay, let's, let's wheel you in now. Wheeled me in, put the little, um, the breathing thing on me for the actual anesthesia. And, um, I was out within seconds. The next thing I knew I was waking up and my best friend and my boyfriend were there greeting me and it was good to go. Um, the pain isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Um, just feels kind of like, feels like a boxer kind of went to town on your chest a little bit. Like it's, it's just achy, sore muscles, um, but not like painful. I wouldn't use painful as, as the word. It's just very, very crampy and uncomfortable. Um, but, um, we found a nice alternate alternation of medicine that's working out really well that the doctors gave. I've got, you kind of can't, see it here but I've got this like pillow thing I'm all propped up um, I've got a leg pillow I've got a a wedge behind me propping me up so that helps a ton um, my mom used it when she had her surgery and so she let me borrow it um, for mine um, I am in this is the weird contraption bra thing that they put you in it's like a like a corset thing um, and it kind of clasps together. It's really tight, but it's really nice. It keeps, it keeps everything nice and together. So I'm, I'm actually enjoying it. Um, a lot of people don't, but I like it. Um, I might get sick of it after wearing it for a few weeks cause I have to wear it for up to six weeks. So that part's not so fun. Um, but my boyfriend's been really helpful, kind of helping me get in and out of bed. Um, helping me stay on top of my medication. I, the thing I was most nervous about with anesthesia was that I was going to wake up nauseous because I suffer from really bad motion sickness and I didn't, which is really good. I was just really hungry and thirsty. So they gave me some apple juice and crackers at the surgical center, came home, um, had lunch. Everything was all, all kind of good from there. Um, and yeah, I mean, it's not so bad. <laughs> Um, again, just achy. Uh, last night I did have issues sleeping. Um, the anesthesia was wearing off, trying to find a comfortable position to sleep in. Um, at about 2 a.m. I did wake up uh, just really uncomfortable. I kind of sank into the bed really awkward. And, um, and then the achiness was pretty bad. So uh, that was when I took my first um, first actual pain med. Before then, I was taking Tylenol, so I took my first actual pain med at 2 in the morning, and then I took the sleeping pill, and then I was able to sleep from 2 till about 6.30 in the morning, and that was much better. Um, so hopefully, tonight, I'm able to sleep better. I was able to take a short nap earlier today as well, because um, the volume makes me super sleepy. But yeah, it's, it's so far so good. I will keep you guys posted um, on kind of how things are progressing over the next couple of weeks. And uh, yeah, I'll let you know how it goes.